All right, let's talk weather now. Did you know that? I didn't. I've never been on the tour. I've driven past Graceland. I haven't been there, though. My sister like has. She it loved it. Yeah, she yeah, thought it was cool. Seems pretty cool. All right, let's talk about this weather this weekend. It might not be so cool. No, though it's cool right now. Cool, but not cool in every sense of the word. 47 <laughs> degrees is being reported right now in Bogalusa. 62 at the lakefront, 15 degree range. I think that's pretty cool. Here is a look at what's happening. Our weather is going to change. High pressure to the east. We've got an onshore flow. Warm, moist air is moving in. And over time, that wind is going to increase. Push water on shore as well. Then we can look to the west. We've got an area of low pressure, an upper level low that's moving to the east. That's going to create a low pressure system right there along the Texas coast and help our winds increase. That's going to send in a lot of warm, moist air. And with a cold front approaching, we do have our rain and storm chances going up. So the Storm Prediction Center is saying slight risk for strong to severe storms. The timing really looks like it's going to be. Sunday morning. The risk for high winds, I'm talking about 58 mile per hour winds, and really for a few tornadoes. That's going to be with the squall line that's going to be pushing through in the morning on Sunday. We do have that coastal flood advisory because of strong easterly winds. Again, that tends to push the water on shore, and tides will be running one to two feet above normal. High tides will be Saturday night. And that pink, also indicating that we've got small craft advisories posted. Here is a look at the forecast rainfall amounts. And the heaviest rain looks like it's going to be to the east, but other models indicate the potential for maybe three inches of rain. So just be aware that there will be that potential for one to three inches of rain. As we look at the forecast model tomorrow, much of the day okay. High temperatures will be in the low to the mid 70s. Here we are, we're looking at 630, and rain is beginning to move on shore. Could move on shore sooner, got a 20% chance, but it goes up to about a 90% chance overnight into early Sunday. So then, as we go through time, there we're seeing strong storms offshore. Be aware of that, Mariners. This is a look at midnight with rain in the area. What I'm watching, though, is the squall line that's moving to the east. This is 8 o'clock in the morning Sunday. A squall line is going to be pushing through. We've got the Po' Boy Fest that's going to be going on on Oak Street. So that's going to be a concern with this potential for strong winds. Here we are, 930, the squall line moving through the metro area, then exits. So by 1130, maybe just some patchy showers. Then it heads off to the east. Now, what's interesting, that's not the cold front. Cold front is still to the west. It's going to be pushing into our area on Monday, but we're still going to have high temperatures Monday in the low 70s. And that's where we were today, 71 degrees, the high, the average is 70, the record 83 degrees. And all across the area today, upper 60s to the low 70s. It was really a beautiful day. 59 now at the airport, a few clouds, humidity is going up. The wind's not too bad right now, east at 6. So as we check out your temperatures, it's chilly on the North Shore now, Bogalusa down to 46, 48 at Slidell, but then 62 at the lakefront. Lakefront water temperatures are much warmer. 54 at Gulfport, 59 is being reported at the airport. We are running warmer than we were yesterday at this time. Calm winds on the North Shore, but generally east at 5 to 10 to 15. So your morning lows mid to the upper 40s to near 50 on the North Shore, South Shore in the low to the mid 50s. Tomorrow we're warming up. High temperatures will be in the low to the mid 70s with that risk for strong to severe storms going into late Saturday night, early Sunday morning. 3 o'clock tomorrow, about 73 degrees, that 20% chance of rain. Sunday morning, rain and storms. They move out by noontime, high temperatures upper 70s. And then looking into the week for Thanksgiving, looking nice, high temperatures near 60, and it's going to be breezy. Also breezy for Monday, which is good for the Saints, I think.